Hi, it's Jennifer from Soul Source Tarot, and I'm here to do a reading for Virgo. This is for Virgo, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus, and this is for what is this for? This is for the month of October. Okay, this is for the month of October. A lot of you are gonna watch this in September. I urge you to watch it in October. You know, I get a lot of comments from people. They'll watch it right now. And think that it's for right now. This is intended for October. Let's see what we got. This is a preview for October. I'm not going to take that. It's too many. So what do we have for Virgo for October? Virgo Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus. Ah, healing chaos. That's that's beautiful. Looks like a tornado. It does. Looks like you guys have been through some sort of storm because the word healing is there. This is healing after a storm has come through. Okay, this is for October. So perhaps now while you're watching this, if you're watching this in September, if you're watching this in October, well, you may have went through some sort of uh, tornado, you know. Um, this this would be, beware, this, is a, this could be a tornado warning. Okay. Uh, but, you see the butterflies, that's transformation. And, uh, so something has probably come to an end because a, a transformation is a symbol of death. So something has come to an end. Tornado comes and uh, wipes something out. It was weak, obviously, or it was meant to be. It's like a tower moment, obviously. So you may have experienced, because the word healing is here, some sort of event that changes your life. And this is the month of healing October. A month of cleaning up. Cleaning up the mess. Healing. Starting over. Starting from scratch, perhaps. Rebuilding. One card for Virgo, please. Ooh, nine of blades, so nine of swords, nine of swords. So it looks like there's some sort of despair here, which obviously makes sense. Okay, so this is some sort of, oh my God. Okay, oh my God. Something could happen around October 2nd, may not be. The timing, it could be uh, relevant here, could be 10, 10, 10, 10, could be October 10th. Um, could be 10 minute 10 up 10 10 on the clock you know what i mean um a.m or p.m could be october 10th could be october 2nd um there is definitely some sort of healing over over something there's despair uh sadness grief by the looks of things this is like oh my god i can't believe this has happened you may need uh, to get some sleep. I think these are like sleeping pills. So somebody may need some sleeping pills. Um, I can't believe this has happened. You know, that's what I feel like this is. I can't, I can't believe this has happened. Oh my God. This is a shock. Comes out of nowhere. I'm not trying to scare anybody, but that's what it looks like to me. Okay. Um, Oh boy, what do we have for Virgo? It looks messy. It does look messy. I'm having a hard time shuffling those other cards as well. Um, okay. You guys have had this one before, I believe. Someone will gossip about all your secrets. Yay! Yay! 
Someone will gossip about all your secrets. Dog fire away. It's interesting because I saw this dog too. So we may have something to do with a dog here. Uh, a distant friend is thinking of you. So you do have a distant friend that is thinking of you. Hat, you will be playing a different role. So you're going to be playing a different role this month, October. We're talking about October. You got somebody that is a big gossip in your life. And they may say something that really embarrasses you or that you didn't want to get out. Maybe that's what causes the tower moment. I don't know. Um, you are definitely going to be playing a different role. It looks like it's going to be a very interesting month. It's going to be a month of change. And I believe it's going to be sudden change. And the change may happen before October. Okay? But I think you're going to get through it. You will get through it. I feel as though... Um, you're, you're, you're feeling some sort of anguish over this. Obviously, it's a loss of some sort. Or change or disaster. <laughs> it looks like it's a disaster. Um, could be dealing with an Aries, Leo, Sagittarius, or a Libra. This one wanted to come too, so we got to take it. Five of Pentacles reversed. There's some sort of abandonment. Somebody may have abandoned you or you may have abandoned them. These readings can go vice versa. So if you are the cross watcher, this reading could be for you. You have somebody here in this reading that is unreasonable. This person is self-centered. They are hard to deal with. Uh, this is could be a, uh, the, the fire sign I was mentioning, but it could be somebody else. It doesn't have to be a fire sign. This person is greedy, very conceited, ruthless, unreasonable. This is not fair. This is this is an injustice. Uh, somebody hasn't been treated fairly. They they may have done something against the law, or they did something impulsively. Somebody, you know, this is definitely impulsive. So there's some sort of impulsive. Uh, action being taken it's really not fair this is not fair so you may be hearing those words you may be saying those words this isn't fair um, five of pentacles reversed this is total ruin perhaps but this is also a turning point it looks like we have an unhealthy relationship that has been unbalanced this is the turning point Okay, it is the turning point. You have somebody here that um, is very egotistical. This person is arrogant, um, unreasonable, uh, lazy. Does things impulsively, does things without thinking. This is not being happy with the outcome. I don't think that you are going to be happy with this outcome. And you're going to need to heal. So something is happening that you're not going to be happy with. Mm, two of Cups. Two of Cups is a union. It's a partnership. Something about a relationship. This is somebody that you are in some sort of relationship with. And we have relationships with everybody in our lives that are in our lives in some sort of prominent manner. You have a relationship with your mother. You have a relationship with your father. You have a relationship with your children. You have a relationship with your lover. This is a relationship. So there is a partnership here in which there's an imbalance. Three of Pentacles. Now this is about teamwork. It's about working together. Togetherness. Compromise. You may need to compromise. You may need to make some compromises here. You may need to work with a team. There could be a third party situation here as well. Ooh, the chariot. The chariot reversed. This is out of control. It's out of your control. This is out of your control. Your emotions are probably going to be all over the place this month. That's the way I see it. It looks like there's going to be... Uh, 
this is like a disaster ahead. So I'm not sure what is going on. But I feel like there could be some anger. You may be feeling scatterbrained. Something is going to happen. Something is going to happen with a partnership that you are engaged with. There's a need to make some compromises. Uh, to adjust. This is a very hard time. It's going to be difficult. It is going... I'm just... I gotta be honest with you, right? I mean, you want to only hear fluff? If you want to hear fluff, then you better go to the... F someplace else. Five of Cups reversed. Five of Swords reversed. Okay. So, expect the unexpected. Five, five, five. Major life changes. Your life is about to change. And it is going to be drastic if it hasn't changed yet prepare yourself okay because a storm is coming mmm that wasn't good I don't know if you heard that somebody's target practicing oh my god be prepared Okay, be prepared. I, you know, I don't, I don't know what is going on, but it looks like this is a battle. It's a war. It's a war of some sort. There's going to be a fight. This is, uh, there's no such thing as coincidence. Expect the unexpected. You have been struggling with something. There's been struggle here. Five Fives are about struggle. It's power struggles. And this is, this is like out of your control. The universe is in control here. You can't control this situation. I think there's going to be something that happens that shocks you. It comes out of nowhere. It could be an accident. I'm not sure what it is. But I feel like uh, there's I feel like there's some sort of I don't want to scare anybody, but it's like a it's it's like a, it's like a, there's a crime of some sort. This is like a volatile situation. There could even be an arrest. There's mourning of a loss here. There is. This is, you will be realizing that there is another opportunity. You're going to be coming out of a dark period. This is, this is, yeah, you are, you're going to be coming out of a dark period. But you're going to, but this is the period, it's a period of healing that comes after the dark period. You know what I'm saying? You're going to be realizing the truth of whoever this person is. You're, you, this is a masculine energy. It doesn't have to be masculine. It can be a feminine. This is like an Aries Leo Sagittarius. You're going to be realizing that there is another opportunity that is better. And that is why this has happened. This person is doing something crazy. That's what I think. They're doing something crazy. And they could end up... It feels like they could end up... Uh, you know, there could be some legal implications here. There could be. This is like committing a crime. Whoever this person is, they're committing a crime. What are they doing? Ooh, eight of wands reverse. There's jealousy issues here. There's jealousy. There's there's guilty, found guilty. Somebody could be found guilty. Somebody is. There's guilt all over in this reading. Somebody's doing something that they shouldn't be doing, and they're going to be found guilty. Somebody's, there's also a stop here. 
Because this is stop and this is stop. Somebody's trying to stop something. They can't master their emotions. So somebody is trying to stop. Stop communication or stop moving or stop somebody from moving or, oh boy. Stop. Stop somebody from being successful. This is a very hostile situation. This is a new opportunity. This person sees a new opportunity to stop something from happening. And it's like they just, I don't know what, they just come up with some sort of plan. There's some sort of planning going on here. Ah, Nine of Pentacles reversed. This is uh, distrustful. We have a distrustful individual here that is very insecure, that doesn't have any discipline. There's a lack of discipline. This person is struggling. They're struggling. There is. We got somebody here that is struggling. They're probably struggling financially. And they can't really take care of themselves. Somebody can't take care of themselves. And they're not enjoying their life and they're angry. You got somebody here that is angry and jealous. This person could do something stupid. Six of Cups, there's going to be a lot of memories on the table here. You're going to be remembering things. There's, it's, it's going to bring up a lot of memories for you. Whatever happens is going to uh, bring up memories, okay? You're going to be remembering this and that and whatever. So you're going to, you're going to you know, start remembering things. There is somebody that is, is uh, reminiscing as well. They're reminiscing about good times and they're reminiscing about lack of communication and I think that's what fuels you know it fuels their outburst there's going to be an outburst somebody's going to have an outburst somebody that you are close to I don't think it's you I don't I think it's somebody that has a lot of fire in their chart maybe you but I think it's something I think it's a fire sign I do think it's a fire sign this person is angry they are very 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 angry and I feel like they're going to do something against the law Okay, and they don't care who they hurt. They don't, all they're thinking about is themselves, and they're feeling abandoned. And maybe they were abandoned when they were a child, and you know, they just don't know how to master their emotions. They never had any guidance. They weren't taken care of. Whoever this person is, um, there's, they've been neglected. This person that you that we are talking about has been neglected. And now they're coming up with some sort of plan to uh, do something. Somehow it affects you. Oh my God, the moon. Truth is going to be revealed. There's no hiding from this. This is a release of fear. This is like a nightmare. It's a mental imbalance. We have somebody here that has a mental imbalance that is very, very sneaky. And they're about to show up. Oh my freaking God. Could be dealing with a Pisces. Could be dealing with a Cancer or a fire sign. Sagittarius, Leo, Aries. This person is blocking. They're blocking their the truth. Uh, they're blocking. They're trying to block something from happening. They're trying to stop something from happening. And they're, they may have some addictions. This person may have some addictions. Drugs, alcohol, something like that. It's almost like they, they get all intoxicated in whatever way they do and they do something stupid. They're going to say something for sure. Okay, because this is no hiding the truth. They're going to say something. And they don't care who they hurt. It may not even be true. It may not be true, but they're going to say something. Whoever this person is is very fearful. Okay, they're acting out of fear and anger. Oh 
Oh, God, Knight of Pentacles. This is somebody that is irresponsible, unfaithful, and jealous. This could be an ex. It could be an ex. It could, whoever this person is, they don't have any money. They don't have any money. They're, uh, they don't have any long-term plan. They may have become unemployed or they're obsessed with winning something. And they're obsessed with holding on to something. Whoever this person is. This person isn't very practical. They're not very realistic. And they are experiencing some sort of insecurity within themselves. So they are going to react to their insecurity. This is like uh, extreme health issues. You got somebody here that may have some mental health issues and uh, they are very, very frustrated. I don't think it's you. I think that you are uh, going to be shocked. I think this is somebody in your family. Or your relationship or an ex, or somebody that you have been partnered up with. Somebody that you have a relationship with is going to cause some chaos that affects your life. And you are going to be playing a different role. I feel as though this is going to make you very sad. It is. I think it's going to make you very sad. I think that uh, you're not going to be happy with the outcome. I feel like uh, somebody may be coming to you for advice. They may be coming to you for help. They may be asking for your help after this happens. Or you may need some help. You may need help cleaning up this mess. You may need help. You may need help. This, this, what the hell? Oh my. We have a separation of this relationship. This is a separation. It is a loss. This is the end of a contract. This is a conflict. We have a separation here. We have a separation between two people that are no longer going to be working together. They worked together in the past or they were partners in the past or they were in a, some sort of relationship and it can be mother, child, whatever. It could be anything. It could be ex, whatever. Whoever this person is, there is a complete separation. I feel like somebody is somebody may be getting unemployed as well. There's unemployment here. You know, there's unemployment and they're struggling financially that causes this outburst, you know? There's a definite injustice here. There is. With the 6 of pentacles reversed and the justice reversed, this is something, this is like a, a loss that goes against you the, we, where you will not be happy with the outcome. You may be, or somebody may be placing blame, you know, trying to place blame. There's like an argument with no resolution in sight. There's lies. There's unfair treatment. There's an imbalance. There's a lack of accountability and there's dishonesty. And I feel like somebody is trying to hide the truth and the, and the truth comes out and it causes an uproar like you have never seen before. I'm not happy to be a Virgo rising at this very moment. Good luck. 